Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to To The Moon. That is some beautiful piano playing. Let's see... What can we interact with? We're looking for more mementos. Empress New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. It's two of them. No, people rabbit. Hmm. Let's take a look at it. What river gave to John? For river. A song Johnny wrote for his deceased wife. Its title is a placeholder. Hmm. Let's head out the room for a bit. We're looking for mementos. Oh. Part of mixed stove. Glass of pickled olives. Someone really likes these. I'm telling you, there's just no way. What if we take it apart? Look at us, John. We aren't exactly at the ripe age of piano moving. You know what? If this means so much to you, I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that house for you, so this is the least I can do. Hmm. A memento activated somewhere. Hmm. Back upstairs? Where was the memento again? I forgot. Maybe it's downstairs. The piano? Was it the piano? Hmm. No, no, wait, I'm dumb. It's upstairs. I'm quite certain of it. The piano music really is very pretty. I, I don't know if I said that. I've said it several times. I can listen to that all day. Okay. Let's see. Hmm, I use four moves. Diagonal. The diagonal will clear these three blocks. Right? Hmm. Let's see. Um hmm. This might be tricky. We need to get the top row filled first. One, two, three, four. Hmm. 
I missed it by one. But eh, I'll take it. It's good enough. Let's go. Here we are. Finally. Hmm. Where do we go? Can't interact with those flowers. Huh. Look what we have here. I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. Hmm. I don't know. Some people like living near the sea, you know. It's got nice views overlooking the beautiful ocean. Nick called and said I should come. I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's treatable. But the medical bills... You can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. You can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Ted and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? Um, I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you neurotypicals think you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish? Even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff to bring back to her. It'll at least give her some comfort. It doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. He said it's called, Everything's Alright. It isn't.
neurotypicals. And that's a word I heard quite often, or used it myself actually. Is he here? Is Mrs. Isabel here? Ida probably has uh, autism or Asperger's or something along that spectrum. As do I, actually. No, I'm actually, now I'm pretty curious. Memory links may also be acquired from exploration. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm curious as to where this is going. Since... We have uh, characters with Asperger's in this game. That's not something I see every day. So... As someone with Asperger's myself... I'd like to see how this turns out. Can we talk to her? No, we can't. Okay, let's head back up the cliff. Maybe your John has something to say. Oh. John's picking the flowers, uh, that's right. So in the end, we know how this turns out. River decides that she wants to save the house more than she does her life. So let's move on. Hmm. Okay. Three moves, eh? One, two, three. That's not too hard. Well then, let's move on. Pick out olives. Hang on first. Johnny's favorite, pick out olives. Alright, let's move on. So you guys are really going for it, huh? Yep, the construction's starting in just a few months. It's a bit of a squeeze, we have to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. How wonderful, having your dream house built at such a beautiful site. You had your wedding at that lighthouse near there all those years ago, didn't you? That's not all that's special about it. We have a long history with that place. Well, it's good to have some good news at a get-together for once. Cheers and congratulations, you two. Hey, cheers. Be right back, I'm gonna get some fresh air. Me too. Well, buddy, it's sure been a while, hasn't it? Who knew how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? That river, still so quiet, huh? Eh, she's actually been talkative at home and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. Haha, <laughs> so I'm the bad guy here, huh? Oh hey, so did you tell River that thing from back then? I did. So how did she take it? For the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange rabbits out of paper. Origami rabbits? 
Yes, lots of them. Ah, uh, I used to follow the origami rabbits from my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits day in and day out. Our house is literally filled with them now. Didn't Isabel say that something like that is a common trait of River's condition? Yes, but something doesn't feel right this time. When I ask her about it, she never answers. Instead, she gets this distant look in her eyes. It's almost as if she wants something from me. And the strange thing is, I feel like there's something I owe her too. Have you asked Isabel? Yes, she said she talked to her about it, but got nothing. Well, I'm certainly not one to inquire, but I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're, and you're notorious for overthinking. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Usually when someone says that, something's always wrong. But I'll give you the benefit of doubt. You're probably right. Probably? I'm always right, John. Wait, so even he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits? Forget about the stupid rabbits, I've got bigger problems. It's a confined memory and there's no mementos anywhere. Don't worry, we can probably draw one out of him. How? Leave it to me. I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first. Hmm. Hurry up already. I don't want to be stuck here. We can't go out. Not yet. Hmm. Okay, let's talk to the bartender. What's with the creepy music? Hey there, could I get you anything? Hey yo! Can I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash or credit. Check. Err, uh, I'm sorry, we don't take checks. Oh, just put it on my tab then. Wait, does that mean you don't have any money? You're so getting resetted. Hey there, could I get you anything? Hey yo, could I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash or credit. Just put it on my tab. I feel like spending big today. Oh, thank you, sir. Here's your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. You're such an ass, Neil. Oh, loosen up. Oh-ho, we have pickled olives. Now let's give them to him. Why, is that a bottle of pickled olives you're sporting? Yeah, are you a fellow olive lover? Indeed I am! Just got a fresh bottle of them myself, in fact. Mind if I join you? Sure, why don't you grab a seat? We'll down the bottle together. Oh, yeah, this sounds just swell. Ever Disable taste simulation, now! Oh, Neil, I don't think I feel like it. I'm so gonna get you back for this. So that's how we got our first toaster. Oh ho ho! Ah, uh, ack, ah. Uh. You okay there? Yes, I'm just savoring the amazingness of pickled olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could uh, find such things to be disgusting. Take your time, we've got two bottles left. <laughs> so I said, hey, that's not right. And he totally agreed. <laughs> oh. And you know what else is wrong with society today? Yeah, I actually have it right here. Why? May I see it? Eh, uh, okay. Here it is. And freeze! Finally! Dear Lord! How are the olives, Neil? Oh, shut your mouth. Oh, that was a fun bit of uh, drinking and revelry 
and stuff and let's solve this memento. Wait, don't you dare. Don't worry, sheesh. See? I'm doing it by the books. Hulk smash! Neil, seriously. I'm trying to get into this and you're ruining the mood. Totally worth it. Let's prepare this thing. Hmm. Four moves? You're crazy. I've got two blocks down here. One Oh wait, these are really filled in. Got it. Oh goodness. Two three four. Okay. Now um I love to keep going, but it seems like we're out of time for this part. So, this has been To The Moon. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next part.